Good afternoon, rail fans. Wednesday, March 15th, 2023. I'm probably not going to be the first one to break this news to you, but the Surface Transportation Board has finally approved the merger between the Canadian Pacific Railroad and the Kansas City Southern. So what does that mean? I don't know. It probably means that the Kansas City Southern is potentially going to be a fallen flag unless they create some kind of CPKSC blah 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 BNS style railroad. I hope they don't do that, but regardless, it's kind of a monumentous day for class one railroads. And so why am I here at Rugby Junction on the Canadian National because that has little to do with the CP or the KCS? Or does it? A couple days ago, the Kansas City Southern pair of locomotives was leading a southbound, led by one of their gray ghost paint schemes, something I've never caught leading before, so I was pretty excited about that. And then that unit magically disappeared in Fond du Lac Yard, and I thought it had already gone to Illinois. Well, here on the anniversary of the first day of the CPKCS merger, what do we have leading? A southbound with the KCS Grey Ghost locomotive. So, this should be pretty cool. And I also hear some horns on the tracks paralleling Rugby Junction, which is Wisconsin Southern. So I think we're going to get a little free uh, Wisconsin Southern action here. Not really sure what I'm going to see, but should be cool. Anyway, today marks the anniversary of the KCS CP merger. And um, long live KCS. This is Rugby Junction signing off.